This year has been turbulent, to say the least, and it started with a pandemic canceling prom for millions of students across the country. But now some students are urging others to take the prom to the polls and get out the vote. Joining us now live over Zoom is one of the founders and a current student at Pitt, Sophia Shapiro. Sophia, thank you for joining me tonight. Good to be with you. All right, let's start with this. What is prom at the polls? So Prom at the Polls is a youth-led civic engagement event meant to take back 2020 and look great while doing it. So we're encouraging students to wear prom attire to the polls and dress up to vote. So we're trying to take back 2020 and inspire students to turn out and inspire young people, Gen Z, to turn out in historic numbers uh, at the polling places, either by mail uh, for the last few weeks or on Election Day. Uh, we're doing this through different social media challenges. Um, and then a live stream that uh, is happening on Sunday. So the different challenges are promposals. So challenging other people to vote with you. Uh, vote tripling is something that campaigns do a lot of, and they encourage people to uh, ask others to go vote with them. And we're encouraging young people to promposals to their friends and have them come vote, uh, go to the polls, and then also uh, dress up to vote, uh, wear prom attire, and make voting really special. So we could see teens in prom dresses or tuxedos in line to vote this election day? Well, we really hope so. And we've had a, a bunch of people participate already. And the more people that we can get, uh, the better. Uh, voting can be stressful and voting, uh, we want it to be something that's fun and exciting. So having people show up in prom attire, having people show up excited and motivated to know that their vote and their voice matters is really important. That brings me to my next question. How did you get involved in this type of activism and why do you think it's so important? I have always believed that every vote matters and we want uh, as, an, as an organization to show other young people uh, whose uh, voting has been pretty low in the last few elections uh, that their vote and their voice matter and every single vote counts uh, and every single vote could swing an election. And we wanna inspire young people and show them that when there's something wrong in the world, uh, if there's a pothole in the road in your neighborhood, there's someone who can fix that. Your local electeds can fix that. And in order to decide, uh, in order to have the right people leading, you need to vote and you need to make your voice heard at the ballot box. So if people feel motivated and inspired by this mission, how do they take part on Sunday? So on Sunday, uh, on our social media pages, we will be streaming a celebration. So the different youth activists who've been working hard on prom at the polls, and um, working with us to uh, get out the youth vote very tirelessly for the last few months, last few years, um, we are hosting a virtual reality celebration for them. And we'll be streaming parts of that on our different platforms. So at prom at the polls, uh, Instagram, Facebook, Twitter, um, our website, promatthepolls.com. So check that out on Sunday at 3 p.m. We'll be uh, 3 p.m. Eastern. We'll be streaming uh, parts of that celebration, and then we'll be posting some great content from different influencers, celebrities, youth activists. So make sure to check it out. All right, 3 p.m. on Sunday. Sophia, thank you for taking the time to talk with me tonight. Thank you for having me.